Hey all, welcome to Slay the Spire. Today we're playing the daily challenge for November 6th, 2018. The character is the Ironclad and the modifiers are specialized. Start with five copies of a single card, not a single rare card as it was before. Flight, you might ignore path when choosing the next room to travel to. And Night Terrors, resting at rest site heals 100% of your HP, but costs five max HP. Let's get started pretty early in the day. Uh, we got five copies of Havoc, so play the top card if you draw pile and exhaust it. Hmm. Not sure. Well, since we're gonna exhaust a lot of stuff, we might want to pick up sort of exhaust powers. Um, and then maybe high cost cards. Actually, that'll probably be a good idea to do. Yeah. So, any anything high cost, I think we'll pick up. And then obviously, energy relics. All right, let's see. I do see a three elite path. Uh, there's these two elites here. And then this one elite here. And the way we have not too many question marks. I'm actually totally okay picking up a lot of um, curses since we'll probably be able to exhaust many of them. Um, all right, so there is a chance of us uh, havocing a uh, bash. Havoc, a havoc. Or, uh, havoc. Or yeah, havoc the havoc. So, right? I got it right. Yeah, that's, uh, I haven't seen that before. Uh, all right, we still have 14 incoming though, so um, let's just play it safe, I guess. No, let's not play it safe. All right, there's another strike. Okay, well now now we're losing more HP than I wanted to, but oh well. Okay, now we can have a two strikes. Uh, let's bash kill you, and then I think uh, did not plan this well. All right, so let's just defend. We should also upgrade those havoc as soon as we can. All right. A little more damage. I was a little reckless there. Now, Corruption might be an interesting choice for this sort of deck. But then we'll have to make it thick and we'll have trouble defending. The grid might be the safer option there. Now, let's do Corruption. Let's let's uh, let's try something something interesting here. Uh, all right, well, this is a... Actually, well, we could defend. Yeah, let's just do it. Get it over with. Now we definitely need some sort of um, exhaust synergies. I think I feel no pain and the other cars will allow you to. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, we're officially out of block cards. And we have seven incoming, and I don't think anything can do about that, right? Alright. We can actually kill him, right? Got a speed potion, and. Hmm. Um, Wild Strike is a strike card, and the wounds are probably going to get, well, no, we don't want to dilute our uh, draw. I don't think I'll pick up anything here. Uh, let's first do a question mark, then the uh, enemy. Upgrade, remove, transform. I think we want to transform, actually. Yeah, let's transform a strike, right? Yeah. Okay, Battle Trends, that's not bad. We do want some draw. Okay, unfortunately we can't defend here, so uh, let's just see what Corruption gives us, or what the Havoc gives us. All right, there's a Battle Trends, another Havoc, defend, that's what I wanted to see. Another defend, great. Okay. Uh, let's do, what can we Havoc here? Oh, just a strike, let's do Bash, Havoc. All right, and then one more strike. I'll hang on for the defense just in case we need them. All right, uh, let's do one defend. Actually, can we kill here? Uh, yes, we can. All right, good thing I didn't play that defend there. Uh, shrug it off might be nice. Yeah, we do want to pick up as many um, skill cards as possible since we're going to exhaust them anyway. Yeah, this is an interesting approach. I'm not sure if this will be sustainable, but we'll, uh, we'll try to. Battle trend, see what we draw. Okay. No defensive cards. Well, let's see what corruption gives us. The havoc. Oh, it's a double havoc there. Strike. Another defend. Uh yeah, coming up. We have a lot of stuff coming up. Let's drink the Oh, I forgot. Well that was stupid. I have the no draw modifier. Oh well. We are gonna take eight damage here. Which is fine. We heal uh, six at the end anyway. Alright, let's uh, Havoc. Alright, that's a bash for a kill. Um, let's see what we draw. Actually, well, we know we're most likely going to draw a strike. Alright, we're down to a four-card deck. 
And we're going to get rid of the last defend here. Very interesting. Actually, no, sorry. We had six cards, right? All right let's do one defend and then uh, strike to kill. And then, uh, yeah, we don't need to play the battle trends yet. Yeah, again, interesting deck. I'm uh, curious to see where this leads us. Uh, Shockwave is a skill. Another Havoc, that's funny. Let's do Shockwave, sure. So weak on vulnerability. All right, this 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 will be very interesting. Um, I think I'll wait for the Corruption, maybe. See if we draw it. Nope. Okay, I do want to play the Shockwave later. There's a bash. Oh, the next hand is going to have corruption, though. Hmm. Could try to havoc it. But if we get a shrug it off, that'll be... Actually, no, we don't want to risk getting any of the, our defenses yet. Let's do bash, because we can. Maybe next turn we, we will attack after all. Alright, let's do corruption. I'll do one havoc, just to... Uh... Oh, there's a defend that I have had to burn unnecessarily might be difficult actually all right uh let's first bash then havoc uh two havocs there one more okay shockwave that's really handy one more havoc for a defend yeah there's no way we can perfect here even if i drink the speed potion we'll still only do 10 block and we have 13 incoming so i don't think i want to waste the speed potion then all right let's just strike Okay, another 13. Let's do... Um, no, there's... A, oh, right, we don't have a Havoc. Let's see what Shrug it off gives us. Alright. Strike, strike, strike. Be a little dangerous. Uh, let's do another set of strikes. We get the HP down here. We already have one less uh, strengthened dex. Yeah, I think we just have to attack. Uh, I guess we can defend too, why not? Yeah, we were very far away from perfecting this one. We got Whetstone, a pick up, a great two random cards, attack cards. Uh, hmm. Oh, Dark Embrace, yeah, no question. Whenever you exhaust a card, uh, whenever a card is exhausted, draw one card, that's definitely what we need. Also got two strikes upgraded. Yeah, I'm not sure if we can perfect the next boss, but we're gonna try. Uh, let's see what Havoc gives us. A Dark Embrace, perfect. More. Okay. Uh, one more, sure. All right, that's a battle trance. Unfortunately, somewhat useless for us, but okay. Uh, we can do corruption, shockwave, okay, and then defend. All right. Okay, so let's see what havoc gives us. Defend. More havoc or strike. We're just basically playing free. Oh, right, we don't have anything in our draw pile. I, I wasn't paying attention to that. Okay. Yeah, we definitely need energy relics. Uh, we can kill here. Perfect. An explosive potion and uh, flex, probably, right? Yeah, let's take it. It's a skill card. Okay, next elite. From the knob. Let's see how this will go. Uh, let's do Dark Embrace Havoc. Okay. The waste of a defender. Six incoming. Oh. Playing our Havocs will be a problem, but I think we might have to. Yeah, we just gave him six strength. It was just one card. That's unfortunate. I'll try one more time. All right, at least now they cost zero. Yeah, this was this was tough. Do a strike for free. Let's just shockwave. Yeah, I don't want to play any more defensive cards. This was this was this was not good. I have 27 incoming already. We haven't done a single piece of damage yet. Dangerous. All right, 18. That's not good. Well, let's drink the speed potion. Havoc. Havoc one more time. Okay, at least we can bash. 
strike. Uh, what can we have it here? Another strike or defend. And here we can have it another strike or a bash. All right. Well, we survived. We we did give him twenty two strength, but luckily we should be able to kill this turn. Dangerous. We got Paper Frog. Enemies with Vulnerable take 75% more damage rather than 50%, as well as uh, Dropkick might be a good option here. Yeah. I'm a very weird deck. We got Juju Basin. Normal enemy combats are no longer encountered in question mark rooms. Uh, let's go this way. Uh, we could take the Curse and heal, actually. I wouldn't mind that. I'm missing out on Relic if we do that, though. Uh, yeah, no, let's start with Curses. We'll start collecting them already. Uh, do we want to... Oh, actually, we don't want to rest, because then uh, we'll lose max HP. Uh, I think we should be fine with 40. Let's upgrade the Corruption, maybe, so it's easier playable. Actually, the Dark Embrace is probably more important to upgrade. Okay, give me a Feel No Pain. Nope. Well, Theosis is very expensive, probably not useful. Uh, I think Red Skull will probably be good. The other ones are really good, right? Rampage might be nice once we exhaust everything. But that might take a while. Alright, let's get a Red Skull. While your HP is at or below 50%, you have three additional strength. So that's going to be active right now. And then, um, yeah, I'll take a Swift Potion. Why not? Actually, let's card remove something. We don't need five copies of Havoc. Although, once we play the Corruption, it is free. Yeah, maybe we don't remove anything. Uh, let's remove... Actually, we don't have that many attacks, so we should... Yeah, let's not remove anything. Let's just save the gold. Why not? Uh, upgrade two random cards and lose 16 HP right before an Elite. Risky. We got upgrade Corruption Battle Trance. It's actually not bad. Yeah, there's a minuscule chance we might die here. Let's throw the Explosive Potion right away. Uh, Dark Embrace. Havoc. To see what... Actually, no. Let's do Shockwave first, because... Well, we're not going to be able to perfect this one, even if we do have like, the defend magically. Alright, let's try this. Alright. I think if I decided not to go this um, corruption route and we didn't draw the corruption. That's unfortunate. Let's see if Havoc will give us. To us. It's the only way we can do it. There's a drop kick. Shrug it off. At least we can defend then. Because uh, we have 18 incoming, we can defend by 18. Okay. Now we get corruption. Oh, and. Oh, nothing useful here, but let's see what we draw. We defend. Oh, only dazed. I guess we draw a bunch of stuff here. Or dazed. Yeah, we might have to rest at the next rest site. Let's Havoc first. Okay. And then, um, can we kill anything? Yeah, we can kill you. Alright. And then we could, uh, defend fully. Alright. And then, uh, Battle Trance will give us more Havoc, sure. Alright, Flex. Havoc. Another Havoc. And then one strike, uh, you. Yeah, the days are interesting because they're, uh, Gonna get burnt and then drawn again. So we should be... Actually, yeah, you're dead. Uh, let's just apply vulnerability here. Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, here we can double strike for a kill. Or just single strike, sure. Add war paint up and pick up. Upgrade two random skills. Let's first see if there is a random skill. Demon form will go great here. High cost card. Very likely to... Uh, Oh, we got two upgrade ha Havocs. Why not? Yeah, here we have to rest, so we'll go up to 75 max HP. Uh, yeah, especially against this guy, we had to rest there. Um, yeah, let's see what Havoc gives us. Alright, there's a strike. There's a drop kick. Just shrug it off, and we can't afford the bash, unfortunately. 32 incoming. Uh, let's see what we draw first. Okay. All right, what do we have left here? All right, let's do Corruption, then Havoc. Hopefully for the Dark Embrace. Nope, that's a Defend. Uh, we can do Shockwave. Uh, actually, 
This does 15 damage. No, we won't even with the flex will be even close. Yeah, unfortunately we're not perfecting this one either. Yeah, this is this is the problem. I picked a deck that's somewhat interesting, but uh hard to really do anything with. Um let's see, should we do another havoc? Actually, yeah, we're not gonna we're just gonna burn it for nothing. Uh too bad we can't play the demon form. Let's just do strike. A little bit of damage. I do I will try to draw the demon form with the havoc. Uh just to shrug it off. And then um, strike. Since we're not perfecting anymore, I don't particularly care about taking damage. Okay, I'll be fine in terms of surviving. I'm kind of hoping to just draw uh, a, a hand with a havoc, but without a demon form. All right. Ah, too bad. All right. Uh, let's. Demon form first, then Havoc, and Defend. Okay. Oh, right, we... Oh, did I just bring my effective... Ooh, this might be a problem. Ooh, this is a very big problem. We have 9 plus 16 coming up, which is 27. We can't defend against that. And we can't kill in two turns. Yeah, I hadn't thought through which cards I was exhausting there. Yeah, that was... That was just poor planning on my end. Alright, well, uh, given that it's early, I'm going to try one more time and uh, completely ignore the exhaust route this time. And just actually do a real run. I also totally forgot that we had flight. That was a really bad start. I could have... Well, actually, I couldn't have picked up more elites, but I could definitely pick up more... Um, Question mark games. Alright, let's try one more time and this time let's be serious about it. <laughs> Alright, so we can actually we have to Um I'm still gonna try elites, yeah. Uh we'll do the question marks and then um the next elite and then we have a couple more question marked options, so we'll try that. Okay, here. Partially because I know, but also partially because it's much safer to just uh fully defend. Take less damage that that way. Um, here let's, uh, kill that guy, right? Let's bash and defend. Yep, now we can heal all of this at the end. And kill with two strikes next turn. Alright, much safer. We got a swift potion and, um, oh, interesting, we got a different set of, wait. We had the same cards and I just missed the fact that we had a second wind. Actually, well, second wind is not super important. Although, if we're going to pick up curses, we should pick up a copy of second wind. Let's do it. Um, okay, well, in this case, it's not super useful, but let's do defend event. Actually, no, I'm pretty sure we got a... I should have actually double attacked the frontliner. That's my bad. Uh, I thought we got a corruption or uh, one of our early fights. So, interesting to see that we didn't get that this time. All right, there's vulnerability. Let's also block. So we almost heal everything back. And let's see if we get a strike. Perfect. Speed potion and uh, yeah, we're definitely getting different cards now. Uh, I think I'm not a big fan of either of those, but maybe Infernal Blade since it does exhaust and we're probably gonna do something with exhausts. Um, all right, let's do the question mark here. Yeah, I think last time I transformed a card, that was not the safe thing to do. The safe thing to do is to upgrade a card. Uh, or even remove a card. Let's remove one of the Havocs. If we're not doing a exhaust heavy build, we probably don't need four of them. Uh, five of them. We do want four of them because... Um, let's also go next for another question mark. Uh, yep, remove another card. This time I think that'll be a, the strike. We do want um, four of them for the collector's bonus. Uh, all right, let's hope Havoc gives us a defensive card. Second win. That was not super useful. All right, uh, what else is coming up? Yeah, we can get a Havoc chain going. Nope. Let's see what Infernal Blade gives us. Twin Strike. All right. Okay. Um, Havoc. All right, and then Twin Strike and Strike kills. 
Um, Thunderclap might be nice. While well, also knowing that we have Paper Frog later. If I didn't know that, I probably would have picked up Feed, actually. Exhaust, it might give us max HP. Well, let's do Thunderclap. Alright, so here, is there anything we need to wait for? Maybe the Infernal Blade, maybe we got something really nice out of it. Okay, let's wait. Let's wait one more turn. And this turn we have to attack. Alright, let's see. Right, I've got a Whirlwind. It's not that great. Alright. Okay, 18 incoming. We can, uh, well, actually there's nothing we can Havoc that will save us here. The defend, yeah, we can only go up to 15. Uh, let's, uh, let's just bash. Uh, we could second wind the Havocs, I don't think we really need them. That'd be also a good idea to upgrade that second wind. Um, we could Havoc one of these. Uh, do we want to? No, let's just play it safe. Strike, strike, and whirlwind. We did do more damage last time. Uh, let's do thunderclap and then strikes. Yeah, we're not doing nearly enough damage. We had the uh, shockwave last time too, though. Uh, let's do second one here for some defense. Okay. Really tried to kill here. 13, but we're very weakened. Um, yeah, this will only do 12. Wow. Uh, okay, so we'll just do strike, strike, and whirlwind. Okay, good. Close. Got what setup? Uh, pick up. Upgrade two random attack cards. Let's first. Ooh, rage is really good. We could make this a really offensive build, actually. Oh, or flame bear. Make a defensive build. So, flame bear would be a safer option again. Let's take that. Let's be safe this time. Got two strikes up. Ooh, I forgot I have flight. That was a mistake. Well, flame barrier. Actually, thundercloud first. Um, we can't. Actually, can we kill this guy? We can. We, yeah, there goes that one. And then 13. Almost kills you. Right? We're going to be weakened next turn, but three strikes would kill. Alright, there's one what Infernal Blade gives us, and there's the other. Perfect. Um, yeah, both of them exhaust. Let's do a Shockwave. Just because it's high, it is a high cost, and um, yeah, this one was where I almost messed up. Let's actually get a Havoc chain going early on. Alright, two Havocs. That was really good. Alright, Infernal Blade gives Anger, and we can Thunderclap and Anger. Right, that was much better than the opener last time. Uh, Flame Bear is probably worth worth it here. We'll give him two strength, but it'll also deal four damage and defend us fully. Okay, we have 18 incoming. Yeah, unfortunately, well, we could perfectly defend if we play. Actually, no, we can't. We can't. Well, let's see what the Swift Potion gives us. Okay, second win will do one, two, three. So 15. Let's drink the speed potion. We are trying to perfect this one. All right, and then just two strikes. Okay, 11 incoming. Yeah, here we definitely can't, unless we luckily have the flame barrier. That one's dangerous. Well, didn't happen, so no need to think about it too much. We're actually really close in killing too. Actually, yeah, let's, since we're definitely going to kill next turn, I might as well play Defend. Save some HP. Alright, we're close. We got Paper Frog, well, enemies with vulnerable take 75% more damage rather than 50. Reset that, I'm not sure why I'm saying it again, but uh, let's take... Yeah, if we want to do Offensive, we should take... Wait, I had a Rage, right? Why didn't I... Oh, I didn't pick up Rage. Rage. Alright, I wanted to be safe and defensive, right. Well, if we're being safe and defensive, let's do uh, the Iron Wave. All right, and now uh, let's do, well, let's keep in mind that we have flight. We get Juju Bracelet, and normal enemy combats are no longer encountered in question mark rooms. Now we definitely want to hit all the question mark rooms we can. Upgrade two random cards. That's a Havoc and a Strike. 
Hmm. Obtain Golden Isle and get our first curse. Sure. Um, I wonder if we should actually rest before the Elite. We should. Now yeah, let's rest. Right. And then uh, let's hit a shop. Or let's hit a question mark. Yep. All right. Interesting. We got elites. All right. Shockwave will put vulnerability on everybody. Let's see what Havoc gives us first. It's a flame bearer. Really handy. And then Shockwave. I'm actually thinking. Let's try our luck one more time. Let's play uh, Havoc one more time. It's a second win. All right. At least we got a curse out. We also have the explosive potion. Uh, let's think. We can't fully defend unless Havoc gives us something amazing. Hmm. That's actually... Actually, that is amazing because we can throw the explosive potion and continue to be fully defended. What happened next turn will be a different story. Actually... No, yeah, yeah, it might. Unless we, we magically draw a defend. We did not. Unless we magically kill, which we cannot. Yeah, if this one was upgraded, we would have killed. We are doing 25 damage instead of 27. Alright, well, let's kill this one. Too bad, we were very close to perfecting this one, too. Two HP. Oh well. Okay. Give me uh, upgraded strike. Perfect. All right, we got a war paint. Up and pick up. Upgrade two random skills. Let's first see. Uh, I think a pommel strike is not the safe option. Clothesline is the safe option. Yep. And war paint. It's a shock weapon for a blade upgrade. That's really good. Uh, and yeah, let's take one more elite. That's very interesting. So so you can have an elite fight with the same elite that you get from the previous question mark room. So. Uh, here, actually, I probably should do... Well, we don't have energy, so we can't play both the Flameberry and the Shockwave together. Oh, right. I guess the previous fight didn't even count. We don't need to perfect, be able to perfect that. Uh, not This one is the one we need to perfect, and uh, we cannot. Uh, yeah, probably should have kept my Explosive Potion with this one. That was the one that counted. That was going to count. Yeah, we can't do... Oh. Unless Havoc gives us something amazing and it hits the frontliner, that is really big luck. Well, actually, no, we still needed block to be able to uh, perfect this one, so it's fine. We didn't perfect any elites, but it's okay. Um, we could second wind Havoc. Yeah, I'm kind of thinking of doing it. And then... Um, Here, let's just play everything. Yeah, definitely the corruption deck is. We needed um, some other relics for that, and it, it was it was a stretch. I don't think uh, I was kind of hoping we would draw the right things, but we did not. Um, can we kill? That's twenty-eight plus fifteen. Yeah, I think we can, right? So, kill. Um, and I think this kills as well. Alright. Got the boot. Whenever you deal 4 or less unblock and attack damage, increase it to 5, as well as an Ancient Potion, and, um... Yeah, shrug it off. Save option again. Double tap. We don't really have an attack that will use it right now. Might, might get one later, but not now. Um, here let's upgrade... Flame Bear, actually. That would be a really good upgrade. Mm -hmm. Second Wind might be also nice. All right, um, sure, let's just play Havoc, see what we get. That was a bash. Uh, Sever Soul for zero. Actually, yeah, let's do Shockwave first. And then Strike and Sever Soul. Oh, sure, okay, with Sever Soul. Uh, all right, here we can do Flame Barrier. Oh, well, let's do Cloth, uh, hang on. The clothesline will bring it down to four. If we play two def one defend, yeah, that's not enough. All right, let's just do flame barrier. Oh, we do six damage. We have twelve incoming here. Let's see what have. Oh, first shrug it off. We have to play havoc. 
That's a strike, yeah. I had to draw a defensive card, otherwise uh, I wouldn't have been able to perfect, and I didn't, so I didn't perfect. Um, let's shrug it off first. Uh, see what Havoc gives us. Actually, Sever Soul would do 28 damage. Now, let's see what this gives us. That was a clothesline, alright. And then uh, Iron Wave. That works. Okay, there's a thunderclap, and then strike, strike. All right, so the flame barrier comes in the wrong time. I don't need it right now. Uh, we could double havoc something. Actually, no. Let's keep the other havoc as zero cost. Let's keep it. Alright, sorry about about that. Okay, so um let's see, we have twelve incoming. Well there's a flame barrier for sure. Um let's try we can havoc something safely. That was a strike. Uh that's the only thing we can do safely. Okay. Alright, twenty coming. Let's see. Havoc gives us iron wave. And a defend for free. And we can right. Almost. Um, I think just Thunderclaps Sever, sever Soul. We get him to split, we just need 18 damage. We did not get that. Uh, alright, let's do Havoc for free. A strike, one more Havoc. Let's a defend. Uh, yeah, I guess seven, second wind. We're, we weren't perfecting, so it's it's not too big of a deal, but um, let's try to kill this guy, huh? Let's do Strike and Sever Soul. Okay, and we can do 12 damage, right? Under Clap Summer Soul. Alright. Okay, so, um, let's zoom. Zoom by the mod. Actually, we do have. We are kind of making this a very defensive build so far. So maybe we should take Juggernaut. Um, yeah, I can. Th there's nothing we really want to get back from our exhaust pile, so let's take Juggernaut. Um,. I'm okay with Marco Pain. Not okay with any of the others. So let's get Marco Pain. Get energy at the start of your turn. At the start of each combat. Shuffle two wounds into your draw pile. So I'm okay with it because we have some uh, ways to exhaust them. Though we do need to work on uh, getting more card draw. Alright, there's one elite, two elite, three elites. Okay. Gotta make sure we actually prepare for them this time. Flame Bear would be amazing here. We have ten incoming. Let's see if we can draw it. Defend. Another defend, which we didn't need two of them, but alright. Okay. Hmm, still no. Alright, let's, uh, we can second win, right? We have 15 incoming, we can actually fully defend against that. Or we can just apply weakness. I'll make it to just 5 incoming, yeah, sure. Alright. And then, uh, yeah, let's burn the injury. Why not? Should have played a defend, actually. Fine. One flame berry within with the right attack will be done. There it is. Okay, we're fully defended, and uh, this guy will take uh, what is that? Thirty damage, so he's dead. Uh, let's just play the strike here. Okay. All right. Um, let's see what Inferno Blade gives us. Fiend Fire, very interesting. Um, well, this will just do. I think we can kill without it, right? There's seven, and then we need another five. That's ten. Uh, let's see what Havoc gives us. All right, Thunderclap, great. And then this kills, and then we can Fiend Fire you. And then a Strike Cow will kill. Perfect. Uh, here, Leaf might be nice, although that's not a defensive card. Headbutt would be helpful to get some of what we've played back. No, none of these, actually. All right, uh, I'll do the question marks, and if I don't get a shop until this point, then I'll switch over to the, um, the actual shop. Uh, no, I want to keep my gold, although this is not going to be easy for us. Let's do Thunderclap. 
Havoc. That's the uppercut for free. Let's do shrug it off. Um, and then... Yeah, let's do uppercut and uh, strike for kill. I'm gonna lose two decks here. And have 19 incoming. Uh, let's see what Havoc gives us. That's a burnt injury. That's really nice. We can uh, close line and strike. Okay, we have weakness now. And a lot more incoming. We can definitely flame barrier. What Havoc gives us. Another defend. Burn wound. And uh, one more defend. But as much as we can, we're still taking a bunch of damage. Alright, uh, so we can do shockwave, strike. Won't kill still, wow. Um, hmm. How about we do, well, definitely shockwave. And I think we just have to defend and strike. Yeah, we took a lot of damage this fight. Let's try to heal it back up soon. Alright, Havoc. Another Havoc. Juggernaut, and then... This strike kills... Actually... Yeah, and this uppercut kills. Okay. We got Red Mask at the start of each combat. Apply one week to all enemies, as well as a Fire Potion, and... Uh, Entrench might be useful. Yeah, let's take it. Um, okay, question mark. Move a card. Hmm. Actually, maybe a strike. Yeah, especially the only unupgraded one, since we do want to be more defensive. Okay, one more question mark, and then a shop if we don't get one. Uh, we do have... Well, there's a bash that's too cost. Well, let's still see. It's useful. It's another relic. We got an Enchiridion at the start of each combat. Add one random power card to into your hand. It costs zero for that turn. That's that's probably the best. Alright, let's let's take the shop before we actually face an elite. Um oh right, same shop as before. I think we'll do uh, Red Skull while your HP is at or below 50%. You have three additional strength. Um actually calipers might be better. At the start of your turn, you lose 15 block rather than all of your block. Yeah, that's probably way better. Um, let's also get a par through, add two wounds into your hand, gain 15 block. And uh, we can't afford anything else. Uh, yeah. Alright, let's see how the elite fight goes. Alright, flame barrier is really handy here. Let's get brutality in, flame barrier, thunderclap. It's a good opener, but it might be hard to keep this up. We can double our block though, so that's good. Um, should we Havoc? Let's first par through. Let's see what Havoc gives us. Then we can't play the Entrench, but we still have a Defend we can play. Let's just shrug it off. Handy. Um, and then we did get Calipers, so if we double our block, that'll leave us, leave some leftover for next turn. Let's do it. Okay, 21 incoming. Uh, let's Shockwave. Infernal Blade. Clothline. Um, and then we do have to play a second, second wind at some point. Oh, uh, okay. We since we have to play the second wind, um, I do want to get rid of the havoc. So let's just do strike on second wind here. Okay, sixteen incoming. Um, it's gonna be dangerous to play the juggernaut because we might not be able to defend. But we can't defend now anyway. So let's do. Juggernaut, Havoc, Havoc again, mm, yeah, unfortunate, yeah, nothing we can do here, we just didn't have 16 block, um, Flame Barrier, and I think Entrench, yep. okay, 20 incoming, uh, we can probably do He's still weakened, so we can definitely do power through. Uh, thunderclap. Second wind would give us a lot of defense. Uh, yeah, why not? Get rid of the wounds. Okay. Also try to kill him. Oh, we're not doing great on HP either. Uh, let's see. Well, let's try Havoc. Okay. One more Havoc. Defend, more defend, strike. Okay, good. That magic flower of healing is 50% more efficient, effective during combat. We definitely need that. Um, 
Yeah, wild strike maybe. Yeah, not feeling. We have paper frog, so maybe another thundercloud would be nice. Yeah, sure. All right, another question mark. Transform a card, sure. Let's transform. Burn blade is actually nice. Uh, let's not throw a clothesline. I don't think I've really used it that much. Or, I don't think I need it. Perfected Strike is not that great. We only have three... Wow, only three strikes. Well, and the Perfected Strike. So we definitely want to remove that as soon as we can. I need to rest here. When When is the next Elite coming up? Uh, We still have some time. Alright, let's Smith. Uh, I think the other thing to Smith is the Juggernaut. Okay. You've got Bottle Tornado, up and pick up, choose a power card, so you should come up with this card in your hand. That's the Juggernaut. Alright, question mark. Uh, uh, let's go big or go home. And we're going home. <laughs> uh, special Relic and a Curse, sure. Uh, we got Warp Tongues. At the start of your turn, upgrade a random card in your hand for the rest of combat. That's really nice. And unfortunately, we're not going to be able to rest before an Elite. Risky. There's a shop. With nothing useful and we don't have any gold for anything. Yeah, I don't think I'll survive this, so I think I'll just uh, heal here and hit the next elite. There's nothing, I mean, very unlikely that I'll be able to not take 17 damage or how, however much I had before. Alright, let's Juggernaut uh, in Flame. Infernal Blade. Heavy Blade. Uh, to, um, actually, we can Thunderclap and kill you, right? Oof, that's actually unfortunate. I kind of want to use the uh, fire potion since we don't want to... Well, we could also just fear potion. Uh, tough decisions. Let's do thunderclap. Heavy blade for 35. That's also somewhat of a waste. Throw the fire potion on you. And then just heavy blade you. Okay. He is summoning, not attacking. Got a thunderclap upgraded. Let's play that. See what Shrugadoff gives us. Something useful. Okay. Uh, here we got the pain in our hand, which is great. We can do shockwave. And I, I, I will sarcastic when I say great. Pretty obvious, but... Okay. This is 19. Not enough for kill. But pretty close. Okay. He is summoning again. Good. Uh, yeah, perfect. The strike is pretty useless here. Let's Havoc. Alright. Havoc again. Hmm. Could have been better, but... Okay, 24. Yep, everybody is attacking. Uh, so Havoc gives us strike. Flame barrier. Defend. And, uh... Yeah, explosive push would be so nice. I'll just minimize damage, I guess. We're still taking some. Okay. Thunderclap. And uh, bash for kill. Yeah, too bad we're not being able to get the pain out. To try to do that. A tiny chest up and pick up. Gain 30 gold. You are 10% more likely to find question mark, or treasure in question mark rooms. Another power through, sure. Alright. Who's our boss? Yeah... I don't want to lose max HP. Actually, it's not going to be worth it to, to rest, so let's not. Uh, instead, let's upgrade the Entrench. Make it much more feasible to play. Alright. So, uh, Juggernaut. Twice, for some reason. Actually, yes. 12 damage. That's not bad. Uh, so we can defend and then Havoc. Alright. Bet we burn it out. Okay, so uh, Flame Barrier, Infernal Blade. Uh, we can headbutt something. Ooh, headbutting another Flame Barrier. So that will give us, what, uh, 32, and we have 32. But, but the, I'm, I'm amazed at how well this worked out. Oh, nope. I missed the fact that it's not coming into our hand, it's going into our draw pile. Alright, let's do plan B, which is power through and defend, which still gives us enough block. Okay. And then uh, we 
Good play, Flame Barrier. Good play, Flame Barrier. Yeah, let's do that. Uh huh. And then we can do Bash. Uh, let's see, Iron Wave. Yeah. Bash you. That's it. And these guys are gonna kill themselves on on the. Um, actually, no, no. That requires us to play Flame Barrier consistently, which we're not guaranteed. Thunderclap. Uh, let's defend. Yep, perfect. Havoc. Bring it off. Uh, shockwave. Okay. okay, we're getting everything here. Okay. Uh, let's... Uh, we can just play everything, right? So defend, entrench, Havoc. Second wind. Perfect. 27 incoming. Can we defend against this? Let's play the Havoc for free here. Another Havoc and a perfect Strike. Uh, yeah, the answer is no. We cannot defend perfectly here. Alright. Yeah, it's just bad, bad turn, bad draw. Can't do anything about it. Actually, I'm dealing quite a bit of damage with the Juggernauts here. Okay. Anything else we want back? Probably another Entrench. Let's block here. Bash and Entrench. Or get the entrench back. Hmm. So flame barrier. Uh, in actually, let's thunderclap, havoc, power through, perfect, and then trench. Hmm. And then power through, and oh, that's enough. All right, we got an attack potion and a. Uh, Barricade. Well, we have calipers. Which is a poor man's barricade. And now, barricade is kind of expensive. Pervious probably better. Yeah, especially since we have calipers. Offering might be nice, but let's stick with impervious. Um, yeah, probably black star. We're gonna hit a lot of elites, although I'm not sure if we can survive them all. Deku. All right, uh, one, two, yeah, we can hit two elites here, and then three, four. We could hit four elites, but again, we have to just make sure we survive that. All right, so it's too bad J uh, pain is in our opening hand. Juggernaut, Juggernaut, uh, probably Shockwave and uh, Havoc. That's Flame Barrier, Havoc, Thunderclap, and Defend. And then two Defense will kill. Infernal Blade, Searing Blow. Alright. Got a Strength Potion, which I don't think I'll need. Um, yeah, Warcry might be nice to get rid of Curses, actually. But we got Blood Vial at the start of each combat. Heal 2 HP. Or actually, 3 with the um, Magic Vial. Uh, we can probably hit a shop later, right? Yeah, I'm sure we'll. Some of the question marks will be shops. Um, the colored card I desperately want. Not really. Well, we're gonna heal, so let's take. Um, one of these. One of these. Yeah, I'm not super happy with any of these. Probably trip here. Um, here purity to get rid of the curses. And yeah, sure, discovery. Why not? Uh, sure, gave some gold. That's good. I'm also very willing to give up my cursor now since we got mummified hand when you play a power card, a random card in your hand, because zero that turn. That's really good. I'm willing up to give up my cursor since uh, we're probably not going to pick up three more on this uh, floor. Alright, we got brutality, juggernaut, made discovery zero. Um,. Um, yeah, that's a corruption, why not? Right, uh, so power through, havoc, and uh, strike for a kill. Okay, here we'll do shrug it off, power through, thunderclap, um, Well, we can uh, kill you. 
And uh, let's actually think what the attack potion gives us. Emulate. Yeah, definitely. Emulate. And then... Um, just bash. Yeah. 30 incoming. I was really hoping you wouldn't attack this turn. Uh, so, trip, flame barrier. And then... Uh, second wind is upgraded, so they'll defend more than the defend. Actually, the Fen would have done 7 extra damage. I didn't think of that. Let's do Shockwave. Inferno Blade. Drop Kick. Uh, oh, thank God. Purity. We can get East out. Let's really hope Havoc gives us something good. Nope. Havoc disappointed. I'm gonna take 18 damage because of that. So disappointing, Havoc. Uh, impervious. Let's just get everything in. Trench. Thunderclap, Havoc. Um, and an emulator will kill here. Alright. Uh, we got Bronze Scale, start each combat with three thorns, as well as Smiling Mask, uh, which is the Merchant's Card removal service and always costs 50 gold. And, uh, another Iron Wave, yep. With the Juggernaut, I'll do a good amount of damage here. With the Nemesis. He's not attacking. I don't want to play the Combust, actually. Well, we have to. It'll be in our hand otherwise. Well, actually, we could get rid of it. Okay, let's get rid of it. Let's do Juggernaut, Shockwave, Perfected Strike, and uh, Second Wind. Oh, we don't have energy. Alright, let's do Combust, I guess. Might as well. Okay, we have 12 incoming. Uh, we'll do Thunderclap twice. Iron Wave. See what Havoc gives us. Trip. Yep, can't perfect this one. Uh, flame Barrier. Well, he's not attacking. Let's War Cry. Um, the Flame Barrier back. Discovery. Uh, another War Cry. We're definitely gonna. Oh, right. It's not upgrade. I forgot. Alright. Okay, 33 incoming. We'll do Flame Barrier and Impervious, I think, right? Yep. Okay, 12. Uh, Purity. Pain out. And then we can defend, defend, and entrench. Alright, uh, Infernal Blade gives us Rampage. Not super useful, but might as well. Power through, power through, and defend, defend. The um, Juggernaut is not being affected by the... Uh, where is it? The boot. That's interesting to know. Uh, let's just shrug it off here. Hoping to draw some good offensive card. Alright, that's a bash. That's not a bad. Okay. Oh, right. I forgot. Um, yeah, I totally forgot. I should have focused more on, um, on, uh, defense here. Especially since we drew so many burns now. Um, actually, well, let's do Havoc and hope it's a uh, Iron Wave. Perfect. That was really lucky. At Mobbing, whenever you climb a floor, gain 12 gold. No one works when you spend any gold at the shop. And preserved insect enemies in elite combats have 25% less HP. Rage, maybe? Yeah, yeah, with the, uh, sort of, um, uh, what was Juggernaut. With the Juggernaut, it'll be a good combination there. Uh, okay, let's continue our question marks, right? Oh, shop, good. Uh, definitely leaves Waffle up and pick up Razor Max HP by 7 uh, and heal all of your HP. Very handy. Uh, ooh, self forming clay. Whenever you lose HP, gain 3 block next turn. Actually, feel no bane is probably better. Whenever you, a card is exhausted, gain three block. Also, remove. Wait, who's our final boss? Okay, no, no, do it right. Let's remove the pain. It's it's not. We're not gonna pick up three curses. Um, and then uh, our soul can't afford any more. Um, 
I think we we probably not gonna hit another shop, right? So let's spend everything. Um, yeah, let's just sever soul then. And uh, I think that's it. Let's also get an energy relic just to spend money. We got a letter opener. Every time you play three skills in a single turn, deal five damage to all enemies. That's the lead. Reptomancer again. You again. Uh, Juggernaut. Vitality. Shockwave. Defend. We can perfect the strike, kill somebody. Uh, probably the stronger one, right? Yep. Okay. Um, flame barrier. Uh, entrench. Okay, discovery. Uh, yeah, sure. Put some strength in. Okay. okay he's finally attacking. Uh, let's do rage first. Then iron wave. That's not enough damage. Yeah, I might as well start on it. Oh, we got the uh, juggernaut being active in the right time. Let's also do... Well, we do want to attack cards, right? Okay. We are fully defended. Yeah, let's carry over some block for next turn. Okay, I'm just going to pretend nothing happened here. Um, so, power through, iron wave, uh, defend and strike. Alright, and uh, let's try to kill here. Feel no pain, thunderclap, shrug it off, havoc. Alright, and sever. So oh, never mind, he's dead. Alright, we got pocket watch. Whenever you play three or less cards during your turn, draw three additional cards on the next turn, and pray wheel. Normal enemies drop an additional card reward. As well as uh, Rob, uh, probably not another Juggernaut. Yeah, sure, it's a power. Why not? Uh, another Bleach, sure. Giant head, okay. Yeah, I like to see that. One Juggernaut makes the other one cost zero. A Rage, rug it off. Uh, too bad. I didn't want to see that, but uh, Discovery gives us. Oh wow. Feel no pain, sure. Actually, metallicize, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then that makes the entrench zero. Yeah, no, this is, uh, this is a good turn. I like this turn. Okay. Uh, here, the infernal blade gives us uppercut, which is vulnerability, which is good. Uh, Havoc was a trip, all right. And then we have to pick one of these. So this does 44 versus. 14 plus 12. All right, 44 is definitely more. Another Juggernaut. Okay. Uh, Havoc. Gives us Field No Pain. Great. Um, let's see what Warcry gives us. Another Havoc. No, we don't need that. Let's power through. Fully, fully defended and a strike. Alright, uh, here, let's see what Havoc gives us, Bash, okay, Thunderclap, and then Defend, here we need the Wound out. Yeah, this combination of Field of Pain, Metal Size, and the uh, Juggernaut is, is pretty nice. Alright, we got Ginger, you can no longer become weakened, Champion Belt, whenever you apply Vulnerable, also apply one weak. So as an Engine Pusher, which I don't think we need, and uh... Oh, huh, body slam. Might be nice. Alright, uh question mark. Sure. Upgrade all cards. Upgrade all cards. You have a lot of unupgraded cards. Um, let me see the map. So after this we have two more question marks, no more elites, right? Yeah, sure. I don't think we need any of these. Ooh, that's a lot of cards upgraded. Uh here. I'm okay receiving two madnesses. Madness I. Yeah, sure. And here we got Vajra. Sorry, you come with one strength. Alright, and here we can upgrade uh, the madness, but... Well, if we rest, we'll rest for 5 HP. That might be not super useful. Um, sure. 
All right, let's see if we can do this. Okay. So, um, sure, fire breathing. Makes the thunderclap cost zero. Juggernaut makes the entrench cost zero. Uh, let's do thunderclap, get rid of the artifact. Infernal blade gives us anger and there's nothing could do, no way of defending. Yep, just just nothing can do. All right, down twenty already. Okay, feel no pain. Knock wave. Thunderclap. Okay, got iron wave. Uh, we should focus on Dota first. I'm not sure why I attacked Deku, and then twenty one damage here. Okay, eighteen incoming. Uh, there's another juggernaut. And impervious. Actually, I made the discovery cost here. Let's see what we draw here. Um, yeah, probably carnage, I guess. Yep. Okay. I should have played the rage first. That was my bad. Um, impervious and havoc. Defend. All right. Okay. Uh, here, let's do madness twice. And then play everything. Okay. And then uh, power through. We can actually second wind the wounds rather than purity of the wounds. That's more block and thus more uh, damage. That's a lot of damage actually. Alright, and then snow. Might as well. Okay. So, uh, one more power through. Flame Bear is somewhat useless here. A little bit of block. Let's just shrug it off first. Uh, yeah, let's actually keep the Flame Bear for next time. Mm -hmm. Ah, who am I kidding? Let's just play Havoc. Alright, one more Havoc. Strike and defend. Whoa. Just had a game crash. Let me really quickly load it, load it up and, um,. Very odd. This is, I think, the first time this game's crashed on me. Usually very reliable. Right, I'm going to open it up and try to replay everything as I had so far, since we're almost at the end. Be right back. Oh. Unfortunately, it apparently didn't save my progress. Huh. Well, that's... Uh... Alright, I think... I'm not going to go back to analyze my footage, but um, I'm pretty sure I was... Uh, I had in the back. I guess it's unfortunate I didn't see my score, um, but it wasn't very high. We didn't perfect too many things. We perfected, I think, just one lead out of everything. We didn't perfect any of the bosses, so we probably might have not even passed the hundred, the thousand. Um, we didn't have any major extra modifiers, so it wasn't that great. And we died on the first attempt anyway. So uh, interesting run. Too bad about that crash. I'll uh, go ahead and report it right now. But yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.